Mr. Lockdown, aka Mr. Mississippi Boy himself. Man, I got Jesse Howard, Lil Boy, and the Preacher Man. What? If y'all haven't already, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, become part of the Lockdown family. And then if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and share it across all your social medias. Also, the original link for this video will be down in the description below. Go over to Jesse Howard YouTube channel. Tell them Mega Lockdown sent you. Just do the same thing you're doing for me over here. You know what I'm saying? I'm here, to, man. I'm just here to, here to introduce new music to everybody else that don't get to hear everything. Now, I don't want y'all late like I am. Better late than never. That's all I'm saying. Sunday morning after church, the preacher was shaking hands. A little boy walked up and said, Can I please talk to you, preacher man? He said, My daddy left my mama and me, and it's been a couple years. And my mama's boyfriend don't like me much, especially after a couple of beers. Sometimes when he hold up, 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 Jesse, hold up, Jesse. Ah, oh, hey, when it come down to the kids, bro. If man don't like the old woman, he dating kids, bro. I don't know why you with him. You lay your hands on the kid, man, it ain't yours, and you don't love this kid. You ain't try to support this kid. You just try to hit on because you can get drunk and you turn to Superman. Or oh, my whole my whole mind thought changed on that person, bro. I be want to hurt him. I promise you, I go to jail to if somebody hurt a little kid, bro. That don't make no sense. The kid didn't do did nothing to you. Especially after a couple of beers. Sometimes when he hits me, I close my eyes real tight. And I wish that place you always talk about was real with all my might. It's heaven on See, see that right there? That telling me this kid thinking about suicide, bro. See, that's why I want to be... I, I get too mixed in my feeling when it comes down to songs like this, bro. For real. Real talk. Real talk. Because grown people like this need to be put under the jail. For real. I can't wait to go. I can't wait to go. I can't wait to know how And what really pissed me off though is because the mom know that the kid is getting hit and then she ain't trying to do nothing about it. And sometimes the woman is a little too weak to do something about it. She she stressed out too. I can understand her situation, but you gotta protect your son, your kid, your daughter, whatever. You got to protect him. You don't want stuff to happen like that to them. Well, the preacher man didn't know what to say And before the little boy turned and walked away The preacher said, son, would you like to pray? Right there, the little boy hit his knees And he cried out, Lord, help me please Cause I don't know how much more pain I can take <clears throat> He looked up with him tears in his eyes He said, preacher, man, I don't want to die 
But I just want to know if there's a better place Is heaven real? Cause I can't wait to go I can't wait to go I can't wait to know how heaven feels Is there a place Where there's no more pain or dying No more pain or dying No more need for crying Cause I can't wait I can make it through it. I can make it through it, man. I'm just this right here. People need to hear this. People definitely need to hear this because this is crazy. This is happening now, and we got other stuff happening too. This is still happening. <laughs> Midnight, the preacher man died a call. Little boys in a hospital doing bad, and a mama's boyfriend's running from the law. When the preacher walked in the boy's hospital room, a little boy whispered, Can you see him too? There's an angel standing right beside you, preacher man. Now I know heaven's real. And I can't wait to get there. Hundred and forty-two thousand children receive foster care service. Four hundred ninety-one thousand victim are negligence. Hundred and fifteen victim are psychological abuse. Over, I think they say over sixty thousand are sexual abuse. Man, see. Then forty five years it works. I don't need you to tell me what to do. See it? I'll beat your kid in there again. I'm gonna leave that right there, bro. See stuff like that, that's happening now. Still happening to this day. And the kids are not the one to blame. You got grown folks that been taught that they survived, so they they end up doing it to the kids they, that the other grown folks that did it to them. And sometimes people just stupid. It's so much stuff can go on. It can either be the the new boyfriend with the girlfriend don't like the husband that did him, the prop did him wrong, so he abused the child. It's so much stuff that can go on. Bro, man, I came to the realization that this world is really messed up for real to the point that you got to abuse a child. Hey, but like we say in Mississippi, 101 down Mississippi on lockdown. Peace out. <laughs>